If a butterfly flaps its wings in Brazil, it triggers a tornado in Oklahoma. Sound ridiculous? It's called the butterfly effect, and for the most part, it's meant to be taken figuratively, not literally. Motivational speaker and author Scott Wimberly is here to explain. Scott, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. Elaborate on that for us. What is the butterfly effect, and how does it apply to us? The butterfly effect, uh, Edward uh, Lorenz, Dr. Lorenz, in the early 60s, uh, was doing some experimenting with weather and things and numbers and he was a mathematician, and he came up with the chaos theory or the butterfly effect, which you said, you know, a butterfly can set a, uh, molecules in effect on one side of the planet, mm -hmm. and then through the course of events, start something on another side, possibly a hurricane or a tornado in Oklahoma. Chaos. Chaos. And it was laughed out. Uh, people laughed at it and just, you know, what, but it was, it was so interesting that people kept coming back to it. Mm -hmm. And in the early 90s, uh, they declared it a law like the law of gravity, mm -hmm. and it's called the, uh, the law of sensitive dependence upon initial conditions, mm -hmm. and it works every time. Mm -hmm. And uh, there's been movies about it and, and books and things, but the thing that I like about it is that everything that you do and everything that I do has a cause and effect, that we do have an effect. It may not really show up tomorrow. It may be 20 years from now, but everything you do matters. This would be sort of the opposite of the old Monty Python sketch in The Meaning of Life, the Galaxy Song, where they show yeah. everything in the yeah. universe and how just. infinitesimally small we all are and how miraculous it just happens to be that just we exist. Randomness. Yeah, yes, the, random, the randomness the of ran it. Right. The randomness uh, effect. But it does matter, and, and a lot of people, Andy Andrews has done a book and some different things, and uh, when people come to, the, to a point in their life where they don't think they matter, mm. that's when their life you know, kind of cease to exist. And, and in a lot of cases, uh, a lot of people commit suicide or attempt to, they'll say, because I, I didn't think my life mattered anymore. Mm. And with, but with this, you, you learn that your life does matter. Everything you do has a consequence and a purpose, and, and you do matter. So how will this apply to us in our day-to-day -day life? Should we be more aware of people around us and how we influence them, or should we be, should we be more aware of how our, our, how our decisions can influence our future. Well, I, I think it's both. <clears throat> you know, of course, you know, your decisions immediately have effect on your own life, uh, and they do have carryover for years on down the road. You know, if you overeat now, 20 years from now, you're going to wish you hadn't or uh, whatever. Uh, if you didn't go back to school and wish you had a, mm -hmm. you know, years from now, that may come back. Uh, and, of course, how you treat other people, you know, that comes back to that golden rule, you know, treat other people the way you expect to be treated. Um, but the, the, the bottom, uh, the, the, I say the bottom line, I guess, is that, is that uh, what you do does matter. Even you think it's inconsequential, you're by yourself or nobody will ever know. Well, they, they may not know, but it'll still have an effect on somebody's life. But you wouldn't want to take that to the extreme. Like if you pull, if I pull out of this parking lot today, I shouldn't be looking at the stop sign going, hmm, should I make a left today? Because if I make a right, I don't know. Well, you know, I don't know, do you? I mean, I wouldn't, you know, I wouldn't sit there and back up traffic for three hours <laughs> <laughs> and, try to, and try to go both mm, ways. <laughs> right, Because yeah. you can't go both ways, yeah, can you? Yeah, and, uh, but just know that your, uh, your life does count and you do matter. Super. Scott, thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. You can find out more about Scott, his books, and following the roadmap to your destiny online at scottwimberly.com. Okay.